Princeton University basketball is off to its best start since the 2003-2004 seasons. The Tigers look to push to 4-0 this evening, and they will try to do such against Fairleigh Dickinson University. The opening tap controlled by the Tigers right down the floor. The layup is good by Henry Caruso. Cook, no look pass. Wow. Nice <laughs> layup there to Pete Miller. Caruso at the right block. Double team goes up strong and puts it in. Henry Caruso gets a screen from Bromwich. Jumper up and in. Amir. Amir Bell knocks down the J. The lead down to one. Bell gets it back. The catch at the left block for Caruso. Caruso taking it up strong and finishing. Henry Caruso. And Coach Horrendo wants a timeout, displeased with what he's seeing defensively from the Knights with the Tigers up by three. Offensive rebound for the Tigers. Down low, the catch uh -huh. and the layup by Caruso is in. And what a patient pass by Steve Cook. Bell catching from Weiss. Back over to Caruso. Launches a three, knocks it down. Henry Caruso, six of six from the field. 27-24, six minutes remaining. Tigers lead it. The layup by Bell is good. Caruso driving and scoring again. Henry Caruso, another layup. It's 31-25 Princeton. Cook brings it across the midcourt line to Caruso. Thought about shooting, now lines up a three. Knocks it down. Henry Caruso on fire here in this first half. Entry pass, Kennedy three. Got it. Devin Kennedy knocks down the three right of the circle. 38-30 Princeton. Bell, waist high dribble. Gets to the lane, lays it up and in. Amir Bell. Left of the lane. Into the corner right side. Cook up and in for three. Stephen Cook. The lead at 15, just like that. 45-30. We'll put it on the floor. Spins, puts it up and in. Henry Caruso going at two defenders there. Tigers lead it here by 12. 18-15 left to go, second half. Bell driving and score. Amir Bell. Cook right corner. Driving to the paint. Outside three by Weiss. That's good. Spencer Weiss gets one to drop, and it's 55-38. Princeton basketball, Bell in the front court. To Miller, lays it up and in. Miller going underneath the basket, coming up to the right side to drop it in, 58-41. Bell gets a screen from Brennan. Drives with the right hand and scores Amir Bell. Behind the back pass by Cook outside. They're just having fun right now. Cook driving, reverse layup, score it. Stephen Cook laying it up and in. Cook tosses over to Weiss, gets it back, now tries a three, it's in. Stephen Cook knocks down another three-pointer. 77-50. Bell gets a screen to the foul line. Rayner three, that's good. Keon Rayner hits a three-pointer and it's 81-50. Rayner. Gets a screen, finds Bromwich at the foul line. The jumper trickles in. Stevens taking off and dunking it with the right hand. The freshman, Miles Stevens. This is absolute blowout city. You can see FDU totally dejected. 2.45 left to go. Brennan at the right block. Hook shot, left hand, got it. LeBlanc driving, laying it up and in with the right hand. Back-to-back -back games in the 90s plus for the Tigers, 91-61. The Tigers improve to 4-0, and another outstanding offensive output here tonight. 91-61 win for the Tigers. You know, FDU puts you in a lot of positions where, you, you know, you sort of have to take care of the ball and, um, you know, you get a chance to win a game, I thought, by 30, you should be happy. But I'm a little concerned about the turnovers. I thought we could do better. But overall, happy with the win. And uh, we get ready for a very good Stony Brook team on Saturday. Once we were able to get into our flow of the game and get a good rhythm, like we kind of got off to a slow start. But once we were able to establish a good pace and calm down, we were able to get good shots. I think each of our games has been really different. And I think that that's the, that's the strength of this group. They, um, uh, it's a diverse team, you know, and, and a lot of different skills, and we can shoot it. So I don't even think we've had, I don't think we feel like we've played that well yet.